Hi, my name is Jake. I'm an admissions counselor at Campbell University. Since you can't be here to tour the campus, we thought we'd bring the campus to you. Hey, I'm Kayla, also an admissions counselor here at Campbell. We'll take you to our first stop, our home, and admissions. I'm going to show you around the admissions and financial aid building. So, once you get here, you'll check in with Ms. Chris at the front desk and she'll take you to an appointment room. That's where a counselor like myself will meet with you one-on-one -on -one and talk about your academic goals um, and your future here at Campbell. So upstairs, we have the financial aid in the business office. So um, really this building is your one-stop shop for all your needs. All right, y'all, so I'd like to tell you about one of my favorite buildings on campus. This is Wiggins Memorial Library. On the first floor, we have our research assistants and a Starbucks. The second floor is a 24-hour group study area and on the third floor is our tutoring center and our writing center. So our next stop on tour is Kivett Hall, actually one of my favorite buildings on campus, rebuilt in the early 1900s after a campus-wide fire. A very iconic building, so it's actually our logo um, for all of our branding on campus. So it houses our English department, which totally makes sense because you can see all the book stacks that come straight over from the library. Next, I'd like to show you our founder of Campbell University, J.A. Campbell. Normally, there's a tradition on campus where you rub his mustache for good luck during finals week, and supposedly you get all A's. But just to be safe, I'm gonna keep my distance per CDC guidelines. Next, I'd like to show you D. Rich Memorial Hall. D. Rich is home to the majors of political science, history, criminal justice, homeland security, and cybersecurity, as well as our integrated pre-law curriculum. Our pre-law curriculum has placed many students across the country in numerous law schools, as well as Campbell Law School, which is one of the best in the country for bar passage rates for you future lawyers out there. Welcome to Butler Chapel with the beautiful stained glass windows. We are a Christian-based university with Baptist roots, so we do have optional worship services for students every other Sunday and some Wednesdays as well. Next stop is our super cool School of Engineering, where we have mechanical, chemical, and electrical engineering. Let's go in. This is our maker space. This is where any student, regardless of major, can come and 3D print different objects, make stickers, embroider t-shirts, and even 3D print our mascot. One great thing about Campbell Engineering is that you're using the equipment your freshman year. So not just your senior year, junior year, your freshman year, you get to use this stuff. So this is our fab lab where we have saws, mills, and even a laser engraver. But we're serious about safety, so you have to be certified to go in there. So behind me we have Maddox Hall, home to our College of Pharmacy and Health Sciences. Since the college's inception in 1985, the Doctor of Pharmacy program boasts an average board passage rate of 98%, as well as a residency match rate above the national average. The College of Pharmacy and Health Sciences offers eight degree programs, some of which are the Doctor of Pharmacy program, Master's and Bachelor's of Pharmaceutical Sciences, and a Bachelor's of Clinical Research. Although most of their classes are here in Maddox Hall, they often frequent the Health Science Campus, which is here about a mile up the road from main campus. So here in the Tracy F. Smith Hall of Nursing and Health Sciences, we offer a Bachelor of Science in Nursing, Doctor of Physical Therapy, Master of Physician Assistant Practice, and a Master of Science in Public Health. And right next door, we have the Jerry Wallace School of Osteopathic Medicine. This is Leslie Campbell Hall of Sciences. Inside we have our lab spaces for biology, chemistry, and biochemistry. And on the bottom level is our zoology lab where we have a pet ball python named Cynthia. So here we have Rumley Center. I call the catch-all for all fun things on campus. So your free t-shirt days, pumpkin carving, Christmas cookie decorating, paint nights, and even bacon day. So this is our fine arts building. Campbell has art, music, and theater, as well as a TV studio in the back. Um, each student, because we are a liberal arts school, needs to take at least one intra-level art, music, or theater course. So you will be in here at some point in time. But you see a senior exhibition here. I was an art student, so I had an exhibition too with landscapes and animals. But, you know, you can get a little more creative like Napoleon here. This is Lundy Fetterman School of Business, home to all of our business majors, as well as information technology and mathematics. Let's go down there and check out our Wealth Management Center, where our Trust and Wealth Management program is held. This is the first Citizens Wealth Management Center here at Lundy Fetterman School of Business. Campbell has an awesome track record of landing students jobs in the financial services industry and all sorts of different banks and financial institutions. So now we're sitting here in a typical classroom in the School of Business. Now this is one of our larger lecture style classrooms of about 60 students, but average here is about 20 to 25. So I'll let you in on a little secret. When I was here as a student, I was a little bit shy, but even I felt comfortable raising my hand in class. So the moment you guys have all been waiting for, I'm going to show you where you're going to live freshman year. 
Now this is a parking lot that you're going to use for a specific residence hall and parking is included in the general fee so you don't have to pay extra to park on campus. So now we're at a room in Hedgepath Hall. As you can see these rooms are huge. We got two desks, two beds, two closets for the students and even some camel sheets. This is Gaylord, our mascot for Campbell University and back behind me is our convocation center where we hold a lot of sporting events including our basketball games. Next up I'd love to show you our student union that will be open in the fall when you get here. Welcome to our brand new Oscar Harris Student Union, equipped with a full movie theater upstairs, two-story fitness center, and a full dining suite with my favorite brick oven pizza. But this concludes our tour today. Thank you for joining Jake and I, and we hope to see you in the fall.